Jolly, or otherwise known as Alex, is a Rainbow Six Siege content creator and an ex-competitive player as well. But who is he? He started off by making montages to getting accused of cheating. Sit back and relax, because this is the legend of Jolly. See how he flicks on two people through walls? <laughs> it looks a little sus. I'm running uh, the garage. That guy's cheating. This YouTube video does show blatant hacks. Jolly, a rising YouTuber, starts off on November 29th, 2017, with a video titled Square. Yep, just the square, not the word, but the actual shape. With a simple thumbnail as well. Here is a clip of the video if you're interested in what it looks like. The whole wall was opened already. I thought it was still, still soft. Unlucky. Good night. Unlucky. Mission failed. All friendlies have been neutralized. They need a ban shields from ESO, dude. Jolly interests me a ton. Not because of how many subscribers he has, not because of what he streams, but the content he produces is what attracts me the most. The content was different than anyone else's, either if it was the editing, the music, or anything else. It was just different than anyone else. Now, people's first videos on YouTube are without a doubt not the highest quality videos. But Jolly's first video was pretty high quality as you can see from what I showed. And which is pretty rare to see from a first video from anybody. Jolly will continue to post these crazy montage edits and keep the same style thumbnails and titles for the next 2 years or 16 videos to be exact. Now you might be wondering, that's a small amount of videos to post within 2 years. Which leads to some inactivity within the first few parts and years of his channel. Sometimes going weeks or even sometimes months without uploading a video for the first 2 years of his page. Now from what I found it could possibly be due to college work as well as what I found from his Twitter. Also, let's move on to another thing. Something interesting about Jolly's early stages is that sometimes he made trailers slash previews for a montage. If you're kind of confused on what I'm saying, I mean that sometimes when he uploaded a montage, he'd post a trailer for it before. For example, his 10,000 subscriber celebration montage. And he'd post a trailer for that too, which is pretty cool. She slide up, down. I be on my breezy okay. shit, pulling holes, tug of war, shoot my shot in out. But unfortunately, shortly after the 10,000 celebration montage, Jolly would discontinue the simple thumbnails and the simple titles and move on to something else in 2020. And 2020 was one of the best years for Jolly by far. It's late 2019 and early 2020, but let's go forward a bit to 2020. Early 2020, Jolly's first video would be a champion-based video. Like the two people I've covered recently, Revolt Robbie and also Shock, posted this champion content too when it was popular in the current trend. Jolly did as well. His first champion-based video was called Budget Champion. But as for a lot of people, they would stick to this and do nothing else but champion content. But Jolly only seemed to do a couple of champion videos then discontinue it, do champion videos again, then discontinue it, and on and off cycle. A tweet I found from Jolly reads, I officially joined the clickbait wave with one of his recent videos linked to it. So possibly Jolly didn't like posting this type of content or he didn't want to do the same thing as everyone else. But when he was not posting the champion videos, he was posting crazy editing montages like he used to, still continuing the montages. And also, if you look back, Jolly also loved the nostalgia of Old Siege frequently posting videos such as Rainbow Six Siege Nostalgia and also Rainbow Six Siege in 2017. He was a big fan of making these, I'm guessing. But one video is important to this video and crucial, and a couple other videos I'll be showing. You see, I haven't mentioned this part yet, but Jolly is insane at Siege. He has some of the craziest aim I've ever seen, a very good player. Like you have been seeing in the background of this video, he has crazy wall bangs, 
crazy fire headshots and you name it. Killing some of the best pros out there and also best content creators, such as Macy J, King George, and the one and only Bolo. He was good, but some people thought it was too good to be true. This comes to our next chapter in our story of Jolly, the cheating accusations. The majority of people who accuse Jolly of cheating are people playing against Jolly in a ranked match and once they get wallbang they say he is hacking. Nah, just kidding. But if we dig down and go back a little bit on Jolly's page, one of his videos titled Solo is Jolly's most popular video on his channel yet and in the first part of the video shows a league admin accusing Jolly of cheating. Here is the clip. I was the one that actually quote unquote uh, accused him of hacking. But I didn't decide for him to get banned. I just went on his YouTube channel. And if you go on his YouTube channel, guys, and uh, go to like 38 seconds or whatever, you can see how he flicks on two people through walls. <laughs> it looks a little sus, I'm gonna say. It doesn't say, it doesn't. No, it, 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 it is, this YouTube video does show blatant hacks. There has been tons of accusations towards Jolly and him supposedly hacking. But there has also been tons of debunks to these claims as well. After a long time of searching, I couldn't find any videos that were thoroughly explained of Jolly using hacks. But once Jolly keeps growing and growing, there will most likely be more accusations made of Jolly, but for right now, we will leave it at this. As Jolly's page seems to be more active at almost 8 videos in 3 months rather than the 16 videos per 2 years, his page is seeming to grow exponentially almost having around 56,000 subscribers and a big audience all over social media. Jolly also seems to be moving away from the champion content since he has not posted a video related to the champion topic in over 3 months now. Now Jolly is posting montages like he used to which really surprises me. A lot of people start off with montages but don't continue them when they get bigger and they usually switch to other types of content. Take me for example. I posted montages but now I'm doing this type of content. But Jolly didn't do that. He continued those type of montages, and no, I don't mean the regular champion crazy clip montages. I mean the old types of montages and style Jolly did, with the crazy music behind it and the crazy kills. One of his recent videos was him killing the one and only Bolo and his clan. Yes, Bolo himself, and getting an ace on the clan. Here is the clip. Sky bridge, you guys are good. No, come on me, come on me, box, box. box. <laughs> Get my ass. No, he's behind. Yeah, He's breaching. Uh, four last operator standing. Nice try. Holy all shit. <laughs> that was fucking loud, boy. Three times just randomly shooting through a wall. Yeah. Jolly streams as well on Twitch and shows his skill live. Streaming Siege and sometimes Warzone as well, but mainly Siege. I felt like Jolly deserved a video like this, and I feel like he is very underrated in the community, and his skill is very underrated as well. Who is Jolly? Well, I hope I explained it well. The content he makes nowadays are just gameplay videos, montages, and even sometimes stream highlights. Jolly is going fast. How a player made montages for everyone to see, to being accused of cheating. I hope you hit 100k soon, Jolly. And I hope every one of you enjoyed this video, because this is the legend of Jolly.